Partners in Health is a health and social justice organization, meaning we concern ourselves with people who are both sick and poor. And they may be in the United States, they may be in a Siberian prison, they may be in a Haitian squatter settlement, they may be in the middle of an epidemic of Ebola in West Africa. And it's a great mission, and Sheila Davis is perfectly suited to it. She combines deep clinical knowledge with abundant compassion and leadership capacity to lead large groups of people through difficult times. Sheila Davis has worked in Boston, Haiti, Rwanda, Malawi, Lesotho, Sierra Leone, Liberia. I mean, it's a pretty dizzying array of places, and she's made a difference in all of them. Not that many people can say that. Coming up, Ebola inside the deadly outbreak. Partners in Health became involved in the Ebola response, I would say somewhat tardily. It took months before it was recognized as Ebola. And one of the reasons that it was recognized as Ebola was because it killed the nurses and the few doctors involved in the care of the first patients. And Sheila was among the senior staff at Partners in Health pushing us to to take a stand, to be involved, and we did. You know, we're still there now. This part of West Africa is the most medically impoverished part of the world. I only knew three people in Sierra Leone uh, in June 2014. They were all three doctors, and uh, by November, two were dead of Ebola, and the third one was working full-time with Partners in Health and with Sheila Davis in our Ebola response. The health authorities were desperate to open up an Ebola treatment unit in part to isolate the patients, but there wasn't one. Sheila and her team here decided along with the team in Sierra Leone to go with the health authorities as they repurposed an abandoned building for an Ebola treatment unit. And I'm very proud of that decision and the life-saving work that ensued inside this shabby place. The proof is in the pudding, 8% of all Ebola survivors walked out of that unit or were carried out. Sheila was right, as was the rest of the team, in deciding, no, nope, we gotta go where the disease is and take care of people when they fall ill. I can think of no better endorsement of the Institute's work, especially the advanced degrees that, that are offered here, than someone like Sheila Davis. She is making a difference in more than a dozen countries around the world. That is an incredible return on investment.